What's going on everybody? It's your boy Big O back again with another vid and as you can see we have my new canister filter the world famous FX6 now uh, if you know anything about this filter uh, I would say that it's probably top two or three if not the most uh, powerful commercially available aquarium filter um, it's enormous first of all uh, it can hold a lot of media it's really expensive but but I ended up getting this for a tremendous deal I went into PetSmart and I forgot what I went in there for initially but I always just walk around just to see you know just see what they have and just kind of browse but I went by the filters because I was already sort of on the hunt for another canister filter I was going to get another um, XPXL <clears throat> which those work fine I've had I had one of those for a few years and, and it was great until I ended up losing it by accident but that's a whole nother story um, I noticed that this filter was on sale at PetSmart for two hundred and forty dollars now that might that might seem still like a lot of money but you gotta understand that these things retail for upwards of three hundred and thirty bucks so for me to see one that cheap I had to jump on it right away so enough of the talk and we're gonna get right into it as I said this thing is enormous and I've seen unboxings of these before and, and it looks you know huge when they take it out of the box but I'm interested to see exactly what it's gonna look like on the inside flaps here um, they have like instructions in a bunch of different languages Okay, so here we have hose and like the output, probably instructions. And this here is most likely all the other parts. Everything's these are the little brackets that go on the rim of the aquarium. Okay. Oh, this thing is big. Not for the canister itself. And yes, it is huge. Let's see if I can. There we go. Yeah, this thing is pretty big. can't wait to get it on the tank. This is actually going to go on my 75 and I'm going to be using the <clears throat> what is it? The Aqua Clear 110 is on the 75 currently and I'm putting it on one of the 40 gallon breeders because they will all be occupied very very soon. Got some new additions coming Got a bunch of cool updates coming. Um, once I slap this filter on the tank and get things moved around, I'll definitely do an update video. Just want to do a quick unboxing, just to throw it out there. Um, eventually, I'll be doing a review on this. They've probably been done to death by now, but you know, I have. I'll do my review on it. <clears throat> the motors looking pretty big and solid and I like I like the way this thing looks so far I just can't wait to use it I haven't used a fluval canister filter in such a long time I've been using the XPXL but very excited for this um, hopefully it's gonna cut my maintenance time by at least a third because with that small filter on you know a tank this big is uh you know and a turtle that messy you just, it's just a lot of maintenance i don't really mind it's what i do but you know if i can have a little extra time on my hands to take care of other things why not um i'll probably end up getting more of these if i continue to find them at such good prices 
But in the meantime, this is what we're working with, and I can't wait to get it going. So, uh, thanks for everyone for tuning in. Hope everyone is having a glorious day. And until the next time, happy reptile keeping. Peace.